I know you guys, well, okay, question, how many of you guys like sports? Exactly. <laughs> um, well, a lot of you, I was not sure if you guys really know a lot about wrestling, um, or how when the first wrestling, well, when wrestling, was, women's wrestling was first allowed in the Olympics. Um, so women's wrestling was first the first first wrestling tournament match was in 2004 in the Olympics. So I'm well. This is my wrestling medal. I obtained it in wrestling, obviously. Um, it helped me on every move. <laughs> Okay, so wrestling gave me a greater understanding of my mental and physical abilities. I never really thought I would join sports. I never thought I would really join sports. Like I wasn't really a sports person in my whole high school career, but I decided why not my senior year, so just went for it. And by learning more about this medal, you will get a greater understanding of the wrestling culture and how I relate. First, I will discuss how my, well, how the medal represents wrestling. Like, yeah, because medals are show hard work and dedication, and in wrestling you have to be able to do that. Then, how I will, then I will talk about how I relate. So first, wrestling is an extremely dangerous um, contact sport, and this medal shows dedication. In the sport is dangerous because if you don't show up to practice, or if you won't be able to mean, maintain stability or in, what? endurance or stamina, um, it's important for you to show up because. If you don't, you don't know the moves, and if you do the wrong move, you could um, easily injure yourself, and going practice helps you, helps you do your moves better, and like, yeah. Um, you can also injure yourself, because for each tournament or match, you have to be on weight. So whatever weight class you're going to wrestle, you need to be on weight. Which is like if you're going to wrestle 150s, you need to be like around the 150s. And um, this is that is a lot of people, a lot of wrestlers injure themselves because that is, or they could because um, they like they go through extreme me measures to make weight like. So they'll go fast or they'll like practice really, really, really hard, even more, and like wear sweaters during hot weather. Then since you're practicing indoors on the mat, um, you well if they're wearing a sweater, they sweat even more and like practice is like three hours or it was. So that's really a lot to withstand and you can like die from that. Um, this medal yeah so in order to like win or succeed you have to show de dedication, you have to do a practice, you have to put in the work to get better, to to be able to um, go through a match, which is like six minutes to well, three periods, two minutes, like two minutes each, but even though it seems like a little bit, you, you're like, you have to go at it for the whole time until you, you, know, you lose or you get pinned or something. And if you, what? Yeah, then I, okay, I just discussed what it takes to be part of the of wrestling. Now I will show you how I relate. So, well, I 
as I said earlier, I joined my senior year, but I never really thought I would join sports. I didn't, I didn't even know like, anything about wrestling with me or running or stuff. But, so I learned about it, but they had like, I learned more and just wanted to wanted to join because of being cross country and my friends were in it. So I was like, oh, okay, I'll try. But then when like my first couple of well, like, my wrestling experience was very difficult for me because I was not used to the all of that. Like I, I hadn't been <coughs> in a sport like that before. Like even cross country was easier than that. And So I just joined just to try, but it was difficult for me because the partner I had, she weighed more than me too, so, and then she was in wrestling for four years, that was my first year, so she, she, she like, she showed no respect towards me, she kept pounding on me, she kept, um, um she kept like putting me down, so, but I eventually, like, I just kept going and I just went for it, so. Um, and yeah, I got my medal my first year, and she did. She wasn't able to get one her first year, so she ended up showing me respect. And um, now you understand. Well, I hope you understand how this medal links to wrestling and how it links, like how I relate to. It. First, I give a background of like wrestling and how medals show dedication. Then I shared. I really and well to and to conclude I just hope that every, everyone understands and knows that you could do anything you set your mind to and no matter what yeah. I don't know, keep going, keep going, finish, finish. Why is it? Oh okay.